I've been really absent with my, my vlogging and I know that I haven't been around for a while and I'm really sorry. I know it's been a long time since I posted anything up, but I promise that I have a really good reason. So apparently I have this long lost twin brother that pops up out of nowhere and tells me he's from a distant planet and that I have to go back with him because apparently I'm the ruler of this planet and he can't do it by himself. So we basically get locked in this huge, long, six month epic battle between good and evil but as it turns out everything worked out okay because evil finally triumphed over good for once unlike anything that you'd ever see in the power rangers or uh you know anything equally uplifting and uh yeah i sliced him in half with a piano bench don't ask okay that's obviously not what happened um Basically, I moved back in with my parents a while ago, and that's the real reason why I initially had fallen behind so much. But as it turns out, it was a good thing that I decided to move back in with my parents because about three weeks or so after moving in with them, uh, I found out I was pregnant. I know. But um, this was a real shock to me because I was told that I couldn't even have children, and now I'm pregnant with identical twin girls. So I've just been dealing with the drama of all that and just trying to take everything in and vlogging just really hasn't been high on my list of priorities understandably and I really didn't want to turn my vlog into a baby vlog or anything like that. So I hope you can understand. So Christmas is around the corner. Who's excited? Okay, so the thing is, people keep asking me what I want, and I'm sure this has happened to you. So what do you want for Christmas this year? Oh, I don't know. I really don't want anything. Ooh, but you know, the one thing I really do want is... And then, of course, you'd tell them what you wanted. But, of course, Christmas Day rolls around, and your friend presents you with their gift after they have already asked you what you wanted, and you rip through the paper, super excited, because you know what it's going to be, and then you open it up, and what do you find? You find a Snuggie, or a sweater, or a keychain, or something equally useless that's only going to gather dust due to its lack of use. So what do you do? What is the point of asking if they are not going to listen? That's like asking somebody how they're doing, and then the person actually tells you, you know, what how they're doing, rather than just saying fine or not bad or something like that. So then you're standing there for the whole 15 minutes when you never really cared in the first place. Here's a tip. If you don't want to know, don't ask. So the other day I was with my sister and she asked me, so what do you want for Christmas? And I immediately said, I don't know. I really don't want anything much. Ooh, but you know the one thing that I really, really do want, a gift certificate to Coliseum of Comics. To which she replied, Yeah, f that. What the hell? Okay, but I mean, at least she asked me beforehand, so that way I know in advance. And, you know, good for Ashley. That's definitely better than what other people would do, so thank you, Ashley. I can't really complain, though. As I've been jobless for the last four to five months, I'm not even bothering asking people what they want. Yeah, I'm a bad person. Maybe I'll make macaroni art or something. So moving on, I have had my first traditional s'more, thanks to my friend Kim. In case you don't know, a s'more is actually a campfire treat that is comprised of a roasted marshmallow, chocolate, sandwiched between two graham crackers, like this. Apparently, every American is supposed to partake in this amazing adventure as a small child. I never got the memo, so fuck off. I am 22 years old and I had just had a s'more the other day and it was the most amazing thing I have ever had. So you know what? Thank you, Kim. Wait, I suppose that's really all I wanted to talk about. Um, oh yeah, and given the fact that I've been like super preggers, um, the whole right way wrong way thing I'm probably not gonna do it simply because it's a lot of work and I really don't 
want to do it at this point right now because it's really not high on my list of priorities. So basically, you're just going to have to get over it. <laughs> and remember, if someone asks you what you want for Christmas, you're probably going to get a sweater. So be prepared.